Hello, this is FMA2, and welcome back to Let's Play Original Generations. Where last time, the spiders came! And today, well, we're gonna try taking the spiders out. So, uh, you know, go all out with these dudes. They mean serious business, so we're gonna have Ryusei focus. And we're going to Tidink Naku! Everywhere you go! We're going to punch the spiders! Punch the spiders! They have, uh, spider webs, which, uh, as you may have already guessed, as saw before, they reduce your movements. Which really sucks. Especially if you're, uh, on a timeline. I'm actually gonna Valor you up. And these guys are actually pretty evasive, so, uh, feel free to use, uh, oh, that's right, I should probably check the, uh, Nope, no battle luster yet. Yeah, but these guys are so feel free to use auto tune. I'm impatient and I don't have Aya, so Well I have her, it's just she's not ready. Yeah, there's one miss. Expect a couple of these, actually two, three, four, five. Okay. Five out of one, two, three, four. I should probably count. Four seven. I don't know, 5 out of 10. That's kind of crap odds, but, you know. Whatever, that's just the way things go in this game. Sonic Break! Eh, uh, just cut this dude up. You know, I sh you know, I really shouldn't be holding back anymore. I should just take these dudes out. And we'll go with the Heizo Launcher. Yeah, these guys, these guys can take a hit. Like, legitimately. Good thing we have Rio, the, uh, the god of war, if it were. Yeah, but these guys are, like, crippled now. So. Best be careful when facing these dudes. When you do it yourself. Yeah, even, like... Okay, so, now Gurna is level 30, and she gained the most broken spirit in the game. And for anyone who thinks... Like, I don't know why it does that. But for anyone who doesn't know what I'm talking about, we gained the Almighty Ruse spell. And you may be wondering, what does Ruse do? Well, it increases an adjacent ally's will by 10. Now tell me, can anyone tell the problem with this? Well, uh, well, I'll explain later. Gawain. Wow, just as I thought. Lieutenant, now is not the time to be celebrating. That blue mech again. It's probably the command unit. I bet it's, I think it's better than the green ones. There's no time for to joke. The front runner's here. Then let's give, the, 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 let's give it a warm welcome. Maybe Ingram's in the blue one. I don't think so. I don't think anyone's inside. Then what is? I don't know. Well, let's go see what it's got. All units approaching, sir. Whoa. Huh, that dispensed! It's the first prototype for the Mach 2 Type R. Yeah, it's like the older brother of the Wessie. My dear Dispense! I see! The Rice Reservoir is a customized version of the Mark II prototype. It's based on the Unit 3, isn't it? Yes, with the right pilot and proper tuning, it can be stronger than any than the current models. This is Gilliam Yeager. I'll be your backup. Gilliam! Yes! Long time no see, Major. Nice to see... Nice of you to be late. Hm. Don't, don't be so mean. I'll make it up to you, okay? We appreciate your help, Major. Major Gilliam, a former aggressor. I feel better already. Who's that hottie? Who's that? He's a hottie. He's a former aggressor who works for the intelligence now. During the DC War, we worked together with, on the high review. I see. You're Major Gilliam, right? You're the pilot of the Elemental Lord. I'm a Sakiando. Say, have we met before, Major? No, I don't think so. I guess I'm mistaken. Hmm. Sorry about that. Don't worry about it. Anywho, the only one sending the humanoid mechs to the Hagane and the Hyrule Custom. Both ships are being targeted by the irrigators. 
Make sure Ingram's Ingram may have been behind it. I hope this proves my fury. So yes. Now we get Gilliam Jaeger. Who is awesome. However, Gilliam is uh well don't get me wrong. Gilliam is awesome. I, I like him a lot. He's actually one of the best units in the game. It's just, uh, well, see, if you're playing Kioski's route, and you, uh, well, let me explain. So in Kioski's route, some of the secrets are different, and, uh, like a Kioski route exclusive is to actually get the original Gispense R, not the Mark II R, just the regular R. And uh, I gotta say, the R is ridiculously overpowered. Especially is the best dispense in this entire game. And if you ever were going to use one, that'd be the one you'd want to use. However, in Ryuzi, you don't get it. Like, you, you can't get it. Like, it's not there. Which kind of gives you incentive to play Kiyosuke's right? Which you should, because in order to uh, get the full experience, you have to beat both halves. And Ryuzi's all third, too. So I'm kind of after him suburb. <gasps> that move. What's the matter, Lutuni? I've seen that mech's moves before. But but that's the enemy's new model. This is the first we've time we've engaged it. It I could be wrong, but I swear I've seen it before. Oh Gilliam knows something. But what does he know? Well, we'll just have to find out. What is with all these guys? Stop going after Rio! Ugh, I understand she is terrible evasion, but, you know, her TK barrier is just, like, wrecking it. Like, you're not doing any damage. It's kind of sad. You know, Rhea's a dodge monster, so, blah. Ugh, barrier. T-barrier. <laughs> I love the T-link barrier, it's so broken. Double beam rife. Oh my god! Seriously? Seriously, Rio? Seriously! Holy crikeys! Get hit. I dare you. I, I freaking dare you. Get hit. Oh my god, she's not got. She never got. Oh my god! She didn't get hit. Rio, you're boss. Okay, so our mission. Our new battle master is the Galwin shot. Is Galwin shot down within seven turns? Galwin retreats at 30% HP. So, uh. Yeah. Galwin is. This dude right here. And, uh, Galwin's level 36. And, uh, he's got some pretty good stats. Uh, he's in his Izaikel, which is pretty much the, uh, boss mech. It's pretty much like one of the commanding officer mechs in the Arrogators. So, you know, that's pretty cool. I actually kind of like the Zykel's look, and its attacks are pretty nice. Fortunately for us, we have to fight the thing, so... That's gonna be an issue, but... You know, let's rock out the D-Rifle. And it's probably gonna be up to Kyosuke to kill him. I'm gonna be honest. As much as I'd prefer not to... But, it, it, just on both routes, Kyosuke's got the best power... ...out of everybody. And, uh, well, actually, I did, now, I did something. I gave Lune, actually, I want to, I forget, did, you, did he get me hit in a way? Okay, you do. Well, I actually gave her the Armor Breaker, and I'll show you how good that is, but you'll see. You'll understand the true power of the Armor Breaker soon enough. Soon enough. You shall fear it, for it is amazing. I know, we get to kill him, who is very badass. Okay, he is in Mark II R. It's, uh, I think this is upgraded, but, you know, pretty standard. Now, Gilliam, in terms of s abilities, uh, pilot, okay, so he comes with Scan, Sense, Excel, Valor, Spirit, and Zeal. And maybe wondering, what is Zeal? Well, Zeal is, uh, another really broken spirit. It essentially lets you have another turn, making it the most godly th thing ever. 
So Gilliam has hit attacker hidden away. So he's pretty much the most one of the most uh, offensively oriented uh, late game characters, or the most aggressive. But seriously, Seal, and you know, dude has SP regen. So don't feel bad when you're using him. Just don't even, because he's freaking Gilliam Jaeger. Okay. Now Kiosuke, you're. I'm gonna need you to. Uh, Rush over here and pump some of these dudes full of lead or titanium, I think. Uh, Ryoto Valor, Kane, and Explosion. Nice. Ryoto is level 32. Yes, more power for Ryoto. Let his let his badassness grow beyond the limits. Uh, oh, I could I could attack, but who? Uh, you're level. Oh, that's right. You're level twenty-five. Okay, auto tune yourself and cheer her on. This guy has quite a bit. I want you to auto tune the battleship. That way, I know you're gonna hit. And oh no, you're not gonna kill, are you? Uh, yeah, there we go. And she's level twenty-seven now. Uh, not quite up, uh, not quite up to par yet. You're gonna need some healing. Eh, excel. And oh, I did not mean to do that. I meant to use focus. Eh, whatever. Oh, I don't know. It's uh, it's kind of weird using the GameCube controller for this, but you know things you do. I'm just improvising at this point. Yeah, this map isn't too bad. You don't really have much to do. Eh, you can pump this dude. Go, Latone. Valor up. And side flash. Side flash. Cyber flash. Oh no! Miss the boss. That's kind of unfortunate. Oh well, it doesn't matter. We're gonna utterly destroy him because Kyosuke's a boss, man. No, no he's not a boss. Actually, that'd be kind of weird if we actually had to fight fight Kyosuke like we did uh, Ingram. Actually, that'd be real scary because Kyosuke's actually really good, like in terms of combat. Uh, you know, I'll show off Teeling Sword. No, it's the ultimate super attack. Uh, use the force, Ryu. Force, Teeling, Brazo. Wow, that did. That's a pretty powerful attack. I must say that. He summoned a sword out of nothing. That is pretty ballin, I must say. What is ballin? I I got I have no clue. I'm just making words up at this point. And hi Ryu. Focus up, girlfriend. I'm gonna focus up, Ryu. I'm gonna need you to machine gun in the face. Oh no. Well, I get to make. Oh wow. It's because it's train. Okay, and turn. Oh wow, you're actually going after. Oh. Oh no. I'm defending. I'm totally defending. <laughs> and friggin' Ryu! She's friggin' hacks! She's using her hacks, man! What up? What up? You, you can't take Ryo out. She's gonna wreck you. She got a. You know, she got a friggin' level off that. She's a boss, and you know, Rai's cool too. Actually, Rai needs some levels as well. Okay. Okay, so let's, uh. Let's take a look at, uh. Galwin. He's, uh. He's got some pretty nasty defense. So. Uh, let's get him into a. Let's do Zeal. And. Now he runs away at 30%. Oh no! Damn it, Gilliam! I'm gonna have you 
sense and stuff. Oh, I'm doing that. You strike? Let me show you how badass you are. Uh, so, Zeal, what it does, it gives, you, it gives you another turn. So, attack. Normally I'd fade out, but nope, I get to use Gilliam again. Which is beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful. And Rio just gets to do extra damage and such. Okay, now where's Lune? Can I... I yes, I can. Okay, good. Now you're gonna focus. And you're gonna alert. And you are going to use the almighty armor break. So, you know, they did zero damage. You know, doesn't seem that good, right? Well, uh, now he has the armor status. Meaning, he has no defense. Well, he has defense, it's just not as good. And I'm gonna have Ryo gain some more levels here. So that's what he needs to do. I need more I need more SP on him. And he needs to gain his ultimate spell. Now that's nine, but I don't think I can hit anyone. Oh, that's mean. Can I snipe? Actually, can you move? Oh no, you can't. Alright. That'd be nice if he could, but no. No, I'm curious. You have enough SP? No, you do not. Kioski does, though. Sense. Valor. Fury. Move Excellent in. He's beam, actually. Focus. Beam Cannon. None. Now let's see, 32%. This should barely do anything. Okay. And... Uh, oh, you need, you need to get a level, don't you? Valor. And where's Russell? You cheer on... Kyosuke. I didn't mean to use strike, but it's not like it matters this point. This is the end of the map, by the way. Oh, look at that damage. Amazing. Now, Leona gets sense. Everybody gets sense. Well, you sense too. Have some common sense, bro. Come at me! Yeah, Kyosu's gonna murder this dude's face off. Like, honestly. Now, before, you know, we fought Ingram, we did about... 1900,000, or 1900,000 or so. You know, that was pretty good. Well, uh, now that we have Armor Rake, let's see how much more damage we can do to this guy! Oh, baby, this is gonna be great. If it's a critical, though. Just imagine if it's a critical. And... he's dead. Now, mind you... Mind you... Actually, I don't know what I'm talking about. Blurp. And, Kyosuke's level 38! Final Mastery earned. That's it. Hello, Major Gilliam. Have you completed your investigation? No, it's still pending. I'm hoping you'll let me let us stay on the hire you custom. In exchange, I brought along some supplies. We're glad to have you with us. Our commanding officer is Lieutenant Kyosuke Nanbu. That's fine. Now I can concentrate on my mission. I've been wanting to ask you. What is your mission, Major? That's classified. I'm after someone, though. But I won't interfere with your operation, sir. So, I'm. it's look like I'm joining you. Gilliam, it's been a long time since aggressors. Yes, you're looking well, Major Kai. <laughs> That's my only asset. You and I are the only former aggressors left in the EFA. Songer and Elsam seem to be looking out for the Earth. I'm sure there will be a great help to us in time. You always speak like a prophet. Really? What did you want to talk about? Let's wait for Captain Daitetsu. I'm sorry I'm late. As Major Gilliam requested, I brought Lieutenant Sabato. Still wearing glasses, Latuni. They are for analyzing data. Too bad. 
Will you have your permission to wear you know what? You know what? What you mean? Yes, Lieutenant Guard told me about the Princess Shine. Loved it too. Uh, XO? <laughs> now that we are all here, shall we get to it? Well then, please take a look at this, this combat day. What's this? This is what com Lieutenant Latuni recorded in the previous battle. The enemy's new black. It's called the AGX-12. Knight? Lieutenant Kiyosuke believes it's the command unit. What's important is the movement pattern. What are you getting at? Lieutenant... L Lieutenant Latuni reported that this movement is familiar. What are you... Are you sure, Latuni? Yes, yes, sir. I... I... When I was at the school, the, the special PT facility, I remember seeing motion to have patterns similar to these mechs. It... It's moves seem familiar, too. Same here. Based on the info, it, we can conclude... Wait... Those moves aren't yours or or Elzam's. They're Chief Carwai's. Exactly, sir. Carwai Lau. Wasn't he an, also an aggressor? Yes, he was our chief. I heard that during a test flight for the for the first Gispens model, Colonel Carwai disappeared along with the mech. Are you suggesting Carwai is piloting the aggressor an aggregator mech? It's a possibility, sir. What? Oh, or Major Ingram maybe stole the Colonel's motion data and installed it in the mech. I've never met the Major, but if he stole that data, why would why use Colonel Carwise's old data? He access to more current and refined data. Those are the questions that need to be answered. You're right. It's unlikely that that the aggregators would use co human combat data for their combat units, or could that? be what they want. In any case, I may find what the aggressors are after, if I check on Ingram's past doings. Very well, please proceed. Yes, ma'am. Uh, and uh, this matter is to cl be classified until we learn the truth. Yes, sir. Let's return to Hyrule Custom. I've seen... I've, I have something to attend to. Captain, please go on ahead. Yes? Excuse me, sir. Uh, Lieutenant Latuni, please wait a moment. Sir? Per our last conversation, I'm giving you an order. You mean the clothes? Of course. The cute ones good Lieutenant Garner chose for you. A woman of your age should care more about the way she looks. What does that have to do with our, my duties, sir? Never mind about your duties. I will consider this a lesson for the future. Now give me your glasses. <laughs> Sean, I don't mean to be bad to you, but is this kind of bad behavior? I mean, you're you're telling her to be self-cautious of her looks. Uh, is this really an order? Indeed. I will talk to both of the captains. No worries. Oh, yes, sir. And we get the Tesla Drive S with the G Wall. We get a biosensor. We get a double magna rifle. We get a beam gladius. Gladius. And we get a remote slasher. We got a thruster set. We got a beam coat. And we got a thruster set. And we got the Graviton Cannon. Quite possibly one of the best range weapons in the game. It's uh, another secret weapon that you can get if you have. If Kiyosuke or your. Opposite main character has 55 kills. And trust me, you want the Graviton Cannon. It, it, it's amazing. So yeah, now we have now that we have the Graviton Cannon, we that will help us out a lot. So, uh, yes, yeah, so until then, this has been FMA2, and I'm signing off. Have a good day.